Every time I look in the mirror, I'm inspired because I see a person that was dealt a bad hand and he made the best of it. So it's not the hand that you dealt, it's how you play the cards. Ooh, I feel like a big old goat out chin, you white people screech, man. For those people that would want to know like what I'm doing or what direction I think I'm headed in, I don't know what direction I'm headed in. It's okay to not know. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know where I'm headed. I just know that I'm following my heart for the first time, truly following my heart, living in spirit and in truth. And in following my heart, I'm just feeling my way through. to the curriculum of how I really feel, thinking my own thoughts, and it started making me feel less amazing than what I really am. By disconnecting, I, I, I was able to be alone with myself and be in tune with myself, and not to bring up being incarcerated, but I noticed every time that I would be incarcerated, I would have that time to myself no social media, not really too much phone access, not really too much TV, just me, just the soul. And I was noticing that my creativity was at an all time high. And then I noticed when I started entertaining things like apps and my phones and things of that nature, my creativity would kind of lessen. So I kind of took a step back and I said, hold on. Kevin, and get back home, get back to the person that you was. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know where I'm going, but I know I'm on the right path because nothing is making sense, but it feels so perfect. I thought we was coming to shoot a video, but they surprised me. It was like, yeah, we shooting a video, but we're gonna shoot a video of you jumping out the plane. I'm like, I'm not scared, I'm scared to death. So. They say when you go up in the air, they say once you jump out, you release all the negativity. So listen, I'm gonna release all my negative energy, low vibrational energy, and I'm diving straight into an abundance of wealth and health and happiness. Y'all yeah, don't know this. The lady, Mama Seuss, she blind. She can't see nothing. So everything she do is she feel the energy blockages in your body and she get up, she remove all the energies, the energy blockages that's in your body. Yeah. You go to sleep? Mm-mm. You go to do exercise? Mm-mm. <laughs> How are you feel? I feel amazing. Puerto Rico, I'll probably shoot the Morocco and catch a vibe there. You know, the new Kevin. The Kevin that doesn't do drugs, you know. The Kevin that went through the darkness and then he started to step into the light. The Kevin that's not afraid to be himself, no matter what. The things I used to get teased about, I done started embracing. You know, I embrace all my insecurities. So. This is part of my healing process and it's also part of my, my struggle. I suffer to get where I'm at right now. It's part of my story. And to anybody watching, 
I've been called the worst of the worst and I've been through the worst of the worst. But I promise you just, if you're paying attention right now, it's always light at the end of the tunnel. Sometimes you gotta weather that storm. Dark clouds come, but they don't stay. Hey, and I'll see you all later. In case I don't see you. Good morning, good evening, and good night. <laughs> <laughs> Have a beautiful day and carry on. Yeah.